Hey everybody, Adam Payne here with the Video Marketing Insider and in this video I'm going to show you how you can make videos like this very very easily without having to invest in video editors or without having to learn very technical tools like Adobe Premiere or similar things. Now I was asked recently by a member of Video Marketing Insider how they could do this. These videos are perfect for Facebook, they're perfect for Instagram, they're different dimensions from a regular YouTube video. So let's just watch you know, 10 seconds or so of this video and then I'll explain what kind of video this is. I teach you how. I'm Daniel Harmon, Chief Creative Officer of an agency called Harmon Brothers. We've that, would, that would do. So what you can see at the top, you have the bars at the top and the bottom. At the top we have branding which remains the same. We have the talking head video and then we have the captions at the bottom which continue and change as he talks. Now the Harmon Brothers are very, very successful. They've got a lot of money and they've probably got an in-house team which shoot and edit their videos. But we don't have this luxury. So how can we do this? I'll show you how. Okay, so here we are inside of a tool called Content Samurai. Content Samurai is very cheap, very, very easy to use. And if you wanna make videos like the one I just showed you, this is gonna be the easiest way to do it. You don't need to be technical. Now, there'll be a link below this video. You can check out my written review about this if you want. When you log into Content Samurai, you'll be given the option to do a variety of different things. Now, we're gonna choose video for social media because we're gonna to wanna to put this on Facebook or YouTube, um, Facebook or Instagram. So we're gonna scroll down until we find the bars. Now, we have different colors that we can use. You see we've got gray, white, black, a pinky one, a green one, and a blue one. So let's choose this green one. We'll click on this. Now, it's gonna be square video here. It's a square video shape, which is what we want. And we're gonna click on use this template. Now here is where you write your script. Those, these are the words on the second bar that are going to basically you know, change. So let me just kind of type something in uh, manually. So I can put, hi, Adam Payne here. And I'll put from the Video Marketing Insider. Um, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to do that. Okay, something like that, something really simple. I'll give it a title, I'll call this Test Square Video 1. Okay, and then we're gonna click on this, Create Scenes for Your Video. And this is gonna automatically create the slides for our video. You see we've got the green thing in here. So first of all, at the top, this is where I want my branding. So I will just put in here, Video Marketing Insider. Okay, and just click outside. Now if I come down, you can see it's automatically, um, oops, it's automatically on all of the slides at the top. I can go and add my logo to this later on. I'll show you how to add my little logo here. Now what do we need to do now? Well, we need to get our talking head video inside of this. Now prior to me shooting this video, I made a very short talking head, talking head video as an example. So I'm gonna click on Uploads. It was not this one, it's a different one. Uh, I'm gonna click on upload video. And then when this loads up, I'm actually gonna go and add my video. Okay, so here we are. So I've got here, test here. So I'm gonna click on this and I'm gonna hit open. And we'll wait for a second. It's gonna upload in here. And then if I choose it, it's gonna then populate inside of here. So we just wait for it to upload. And there are a couple of things we need to do in order for this to work successfully. So it's almost uploaded. Give it a second. You can see the little blue blast flashing. And don't worry, I'm gonna show you how to create the talking head video in a second. It's really simple, but it's an important part of this step. We just wanna get this uploaded first. So I think it was this one. Okay, so we'll click on that. And you see now that comes in here. There's my ugly face. And as I scroll down, Let's scroll down to scene two. Scene two, I can just click it again. Now the problem, and we, we can do this for as many um, scenes as we've got. So we'll put that in here. Um, and then the last one, we'll put it in here. So now my video is in all the scenes. Now the problem is, in each scene, my video starts to play again from the start, which isn't gonna make much sense. So what we need to do is we need to scroll down to the second scene and we need to uh, we need to link, 
we need to make sure that it's linked. Okay, we need to make sure that this is linked. So every time we do this, we need to make sure that this link is highlighted. So it's highlighted. Okay, it's highlighted. Okay. So once that link is there, we can then come down and change the bottom text. So hi, Adam Payne here from the Video Marketing Insider. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a square video. And if you want to, of course, you can bold some things or you can underline some things. Now, once you're good to go and you're happy, you can then hit voice and you can upload a voice track. So I'm going to upload a voice track and it's the it's the audio of my video. So I'm going to click on this. Uh, I've got test audio here. It's a WAV file. You can have a W uh, an MP3 file if you want to. So now because it's the exact audio from my video, it should be automatically synced perfectly. We'll let this um, upload and then I'm going to show you how I created this. Give me a second. Okay, so before we before I press play, I'm going to head on over to somewhere else and I'm going to show you how this video was made. So let's go and have a look. Okay, so here we are inside of a video editor. This one is called Camtasia. It doesn't really matter which video editor you have. So the first thing that I did was I recorded my talking head video as a sample. So this one, as you can see, it's about 12 seconds long. Once you record your video, there's a couple of things you need to do. You need to export this video so that it's a square video when you export it. And that means making sure that you get the dimensions right. So inside of Camtasia, what you do is you click on the uh, share icon, you come to advanced exports, and then you click on options, and then you click on dimensions and custom, and then you can type in, if they're not already populating here, you can type in these numbers, 1080 by 1080. Hit OK, and then you export. And that will export the video in a square shape. Now, before you finish, once the video has exported, you also need to make sure that you extract and export the audio as well. So as you can see here, my video and audio are together. So I, in Camtasia, I'll click on Edit, Separate Audio and Video. Now I have the video and the audio. So the video I can delete because that's already been exported. And then I need to export the exact same audio. So I would click on the uh, same thing, advanced export. But in this case, it's not an MP4 file because it's not a video. It's a WAV file. Now, if you have MP3 as an option, that's fine too. And then you would export that. That way you will have both the, aud the audio on your computer and you will have the square file on your computer that I've been showing you and I'm going to continue to show you from here on in inside of Content Samurai. So let's head on back. Okay, so you saw there how I made the video itself and then how I got the square dimensions. You saw how I got the audio as well. I was using Camtasia. Now we can hit um, preview. You can hit preview here or preview here. So let's hit preview. And of course, if it's a longer video, this will take you know a couple of minutes sometimes. It really depends on how long your video is and the connection. And if you make any mistakes, if you notice any typos or anything wrong, then you can kind of come back. So let's press play. Hi, uh, uh, yeah. Just a little test video to show you how to utilize Content Samurai to make square videos for, for example, Facebook. So you get the idea, okay? Now you might have heard a little bit of a stutter thing at the start, and you may think that this doesn't look clear. This is purely because this is a low resolution video of the video. So uh, you can manually adjust the timing. If I click here, manually adjust, this is where you can actually move the slides back and forth to sync perfectly with any audio that you may have. Now I'm not gonna do this for this video because it'll take too long. There's tons of tutorials inside of Content Samurai, but it's super easy to do. So I'm happy. So I'm going to hit download and it's going to generate my video. So let me hit generate and I'm going to pause while this goes and generates and come back in a sec. Okay, so it's generated. I've downloaded the video. In fact, let me just download it again to show you. Click on this little link. It downloads the video. Let's double click on it. Opens up. Let's press play. Hi, Adam here. Just a little test video to show you how to utilize Content Samurai to make square videos for, for example, how simple was that? Now, one thing I forgot to show you was the actual uh, watermark. So if we go back to preview, I 
think it's in here. I could be wrong, but I want to just double check because we want to add our logo to our actual video as well. And I neglected to show you how to do that. So assuming you've got your logo on your computer, you would click on watermark. You would either create a new watermark or you would upload it um, as normal, or you could come to a pre-uploaded one. So I'll click on this and you can see now I've got my logo in here. When you actually create your logo, your watermark, I should say, you can make it bigger, smaller. You can drag and drop it um, across the video. You can't do it in here. You've got to do it inside of here. It's very simple to do. So you can put your video watermark here, 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 make it big, make it small. And then when you download your video again, it will have your watermark in there. So just to summarize, what do we need to do? We need to first record our talking head video, either it's us or an actor. Export that video 1080 by 1080 onto your computer. You then need to export the audio of that video. So you don't need to create a new audio. You just extract the audio like I showed you previously. Download that audio as an MP3 or a WAV file. It's irrelevant. Come into this tool, Content Samurai, uh, and then do what I've showed you. You know, you can paste in your script. You can upload your video, you can upload your audio, make sure it's all synced together, add your little watermark, bingo. You've got a perfect video for Facebook ads or Instagram that you can upload and use to your heart's content without having to spend a lot of money on video editors and without having to learn very technical tools. If you wanna check out Content Samurai, I use it, I recommend it to a lot of people. There's a link below to check it out. Other than that, thank you for watching and give me a like, subscribe or ask me any questions if you have them. Cheers.